Hi all, welcome to another RP tutorial video. In this video, we are going to see how the bot is working with the stock exchange share data. So here we will see bot is going to read the data from the input Excel and it will extract the share price from the Google Finance and also it is going to suggest to user whether the particular stock is running in a loss or it is running in a profit okay so before start in case if you are visiting this channel for the first time I would request you to kindly subscribe our channel to get more RP related video okay so this small process which I am going to demonstrate to you is very helpful for uh, those who are very new to the RPA or a student who is learning RPA so I would request you to kindly replicate this uh, process uh, using automation anywhere a 2019 or whatever tool you are using so it will give you a little idea about the de development background okay so let me go to the automation anywhere to show you the code so before showing the code let me go to the excel which I am going to use here so this is the input excel so here I have currently 10 uh, stock name so you can see here so based on your requirement you can put 10 50 20 whatever number you want and our bot will read data from this excel so whatever number will be there it will read and it will uh, try to extract the information so we have the field here like stock name target price current price the status like you know the gain or loss and this is the final status so this is the target price which I have given for these shares okay and the current price is going to read by the bot from the googlefinance.com based on this excel formula it will say uh, it will show you whether the stock is running in a loss or a profit okay so once we start the bot bot will delete this uh, current price and it will face the data and it will put into this particular excel so let me close this excel now i'm going to the automation anywhere so you can see i have already uh, written this code for you so you can try and you can let me know in case of any problem so let me take you through the code so you can see i have added the error handling so here bot is trying to launch the page and so basically here bot will try for maximum five times okay so you can see here I have built the logic and everything then here I'm using mostly the object cloning and also I'm using keystrokes okay and the Excel operation so this is the code so the our main code is starting from here so bot will start reading data from this loop and it will put the information okay all right so now I'm just closing this I will run this code from the automation anywhere control room so I've already uploaded the code so now let me log in with my bot runner access okay I have logged in now the code is already uh, available in the control room so now I'm going to the automation anywhere control room I'll go to the bots I will go to my bots and from there I have the folder called stock market here I have the bot so I will select this bot and from here I will click on the run bot so as soon as you click on run bot it will ask you to select the bot runner so currently I have one bot runner which is available in this system I will select that and I will click on the run now so once you click on run now the bot will automatically start running so you can see so bot is giving you the message box the process started okay so you can see it has launched the Google Finance successfully and it is showing in the message box the current uh, sensex and the nifty uh, value which is available so this bot is a uh, very helpful for those who is doing the trading okay so this bot can be scheduled and it can run uh, during a particular time period for example our um, uh, Indian stock exchange timing is let's say the 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. so we can schedule this bot and this bot can run whatever time or like you know based on some trigger we can uh, put those triggers so it can run and it, it can face the data and also we can put some uh, like uh, a concept of um, like you know sending uh, messages or 
the email and other things can be done also so this is very helpful in case if you are looking for some solutions like um, where bot uh, is going to read all the data based on the um, a certain like you know the target price the bot can inform the particular user to sell or keep this particular stock so you can see so whenever we are um, getting uh, like in the current price is more than the target price the message box is showing okay so this is done now now let me go to the excel so you can see the excel is updated now so this is the data we can say like you know this uh, five stock which is running in the profit so if somebody wants to sell this uh, stock in case if they are holding they can sell this stock so yes so in case if you are uh, looking for this code i would request you to kindly uh, send us an email at rpa.developers1 at gmail.com we will send you the code or in case if you have any query or if you face any challenge challenges in terms of developing this code please uh, mail us we will definitely help you so uh, thank you so much for watching this video thank you